big beautiful 32 foot triple slide Jayco Eagle Premier. The Premier series is the largest eagle. It comes off the same line as their pinnacle. Has a lot of the same features as a result. Uh, something that we always like to add to these is the Moride pin box. Uh, if you're not familiar with this, you need to call us and have us give you some information on it because it absolutely enhances and improves your towing experience. Um, we're looking at generator preparation right here. Pick out the generator of your choice and toss it in there and it's all wired up and ready. Um, this is high gloss gel coat and this is a, uh, a uh, fully vacuum laminated product with the front uh, nose cap. Um, I mentioned it's a triple slide. We've got a uh, bedroom slide out and then uh, living room super slide on this side and full depth, I think it's recliners on the other side. Um, Eagle Premier's standard are four seasons ready. They are insulated to handle that kind of weather. Um, 10 cubic foot refrigerator freezer there, um, which is, geez, almost 50% larger than standard in, in most of these fifth wheels nowadays. But Jayco doesn't cut corners. One of the cool things I always like to point out, I usually forget about it, is the uh, remote control system. Your slides, your jacks, your awning, they're all remote controllable. So if uh, you have a campsite where you're trying to pull up and you have to make sure you don't hit a tree with your slide out, you can walk out there yourself and make sure you don't clip it. See the twin rocking recliners. Um, this is 50 amp service and we do add the second air to the bedroom. So this is perfect for hot or cold weather camping. Um, rear entertainment back there, we, we, you can kind of see the, the hint of where the TV would come up above the fireplace. And your stereo unit, your DVD unit is hidden over here. I believe this is, I think it's a 40 inch TV, I, I could be a little bit wrong in there, it might be a titch bigger, um, I'll have to check the spec sheet on it, but the TV mounts on there, which is included with the camper, and uh, it's on an electric lift that just pops up and down. The height of bed that we're uh, looking at right there has a storage drawer underneath, so you do have more storage, and obviously we're not hurting for windows in this model, we've got windows everywhere. Um, the tabletop does uh, extend for uh, extra folks and that actually hides that it's locked right now and I only have one hand but um, it's kind of like a residential leaf table system and look at those kitchen cabinets those are sharp looking I like those better than the cabinets in my house um, we've got the larger oversized oven for the campsite cook in your family all of your drawers in this are um, you know, full extension you notice that it's all plywood construction these are the heavier grade ball bearing guides. Um, you know, the extra little work and touches like the trim on the cabinets they put in here. They don't cut any corners anywhere. All of your uh, cabinetry is residential, you know, hidden hinge cabinetry. And this is all, uh, you know, we're looking at real wood in here. It's not press board or anything cheap like that. Um, I like the hallway up to the bed and bath area. Uh, I, first of all, I just think the glass insert on that door looks great, but then the uh, the big window here lets a lot of light in there. And all of your windows have both the day and night shades on them. So you can get privacy and light, or you can block out the sun if you want to take a nap. Uh, we've got the, uh, the bathroom set up here. It has the uh, oversized, commonly called fantastic fan. Full size standing shower, no tub, so there's no step up. Um, if you're an older camper uh, with a little bit, oops, a little bit limited mobility, this is a good setup for you. And huge, huge bathroom sink. Um, it's amazing to me how many fifth wheels, um, you know, have these little miniature illusions of sinks as opposed to an actual real sink that you can wash your hands in. Um, up here in the bedroom, the uh, second TV, which is included, we've opted that in, mounts right there in that bracket. Um, the slatted cabinet you're looking at over here, that is uh, washer dryer ready. Um, the way it's set up, it's perfect for a combo-matic. However, if you would like to, you can put a stackable in here. The only trick with that is you have to remove that panel right there, which isn't hard. But it's, uh, that, that's the only thing you need to do to put a stackable in here. Cool thing about Jayco's with their beds, let me see if I can do this with one hand, 
is their beds. Oh, easy. Have full under storage. Most fifth wheel beds do not. Well, fifth wheel bedroom slides do not because most manufacturers hide the slide out motor under here. Jayco's are actually mounted within the wall with their new Schwintec system. It uh, works very well. Plus, the wardrobe up here is absolutely enormous. The camera really doesn't do it justice and give it proper scale. But that's called a walk-in closet and they're not kidding. Um, the other thing to mention is Jayco insulates their wardrobe floors. You would be shocked how many of these big high-end, allegedly high-end fifth wheels don't do things like that. They won't insulate the floor of the slide. Uh, well, that's, that's right where you guys are sleeping. If that's not insulated, you're either going to be freezing or sweating all night. Um, so give us a call. They don't cut any corners here. There's a reason this has basically twice the warranty of anything else built in its class. 800-256-5196. Hale it Auto and RV of Coldwater, Michigan. Thanks, guys.